today we're going to show you how to introduce mum muffs. We're using this to dampen the sound of fireworks. So the first step is nose targeting. Asher touches it with her nose and she gets marked and rewarded. This was repeated many times. Next session we started working on Asher putting her nose further through the muzzle, through the uh, mutt muffs. And getting marked and rewarded when she does. I'm throwing the treats away so she has to reset. Now we're just working a little farther and I've also closed the chin strap so to encourage her to be a little closer to the top of the mutt muffs. Now she was getting a little stuck so I added movement to encourage her to put her head a little farther through because so I want her putting her head all the way to having her ears inside the muffs. Now I removed the movement so that we could go back to sitting. In some of these videos you might see me moving my hands so that the mutt muffs go farther on. Ideally this would not happen. We should keep our hands still. Now in some of these sessions I'm marking with a clicker and other ones I'm using a verbal marker. You can use either. Now we're going to work on duration. Starting very slowly with just a few seconds and going up to longer sessions. I'm rewarding on the mat, get her moving around a little bit and keeping a steady flow of treats. We don't want her to start pawing the mutt muffs. If she does paw, we've gone too fast. Now each one of these steps took us about five to ten minutes in separate sessions. We want to keep sessions short and you want to set the dog up for success so it is being successful several times a minute. And you want to start this training at least one month before fireworks season so you're not rushed. All these videos were taken in six days, but it might take you longer. 